Hello, I'm Axel Carolyn, which I pronounced correctly because I'm Axel Carolyn. This is Trailers from Hell, and we're going to look at the trailer for 1962's, <laughs> Joe is so bored, 1962's political thriller, The Manchurian Candidate, starring Frank Sinatra, Lawrence Harvey, Janet Lee, James Gregory, and in a brilliant performance, Angela Lansbury. It is wonderfully directed by John Frankenheimer, based on a novel of the same name by Richard Condon, with a dazzling screenplay by George Axelrod, who also wrote, Will Success Spoil Rock Hunter and The Seven Year Itch, and who was a wonderful person and made a very mean martini. The outrageous premise of the Manchurian candidate is that right-wing Republicans are actually doing the bidding of Soviet communist Russia it's kind of prescient, considering our current president and his party are clearly doing the bidding of Vladimir Putin. It's downright bizarre, isn't it? The Korean War is over, and this movie concerns post-traumatic stress from Korean War veterans. It also concerns brainwashing. This is interesting, Henry Silva, Frank Sinatra, this is the first karate fight in an American motion picture. Anyway, this concerns the Queen of Diamonds, that will make sense to you later, an assassination attempt. This is a horrible murder by Lawrence Harvey, who is doing the bidding of his Soviet contact. There's a wonderful sequence in the beginning where the veterans are having terrible flashbacks to their brainwashing when they were captured in Manchuria. Lawrence Harvey, that's the wonderful Kai D as the evil Chinese, red Chinese. Lawrence Harvey as the pathetic victim. Janet Lee has this amazing character. She picks up Frank Sinatra on a train and seduces him. It's, it's really kind of like, what? Anyway, Angela Lansbury is married to James Gregory, who is kind of a buffoonish, right-wing, Joe McCarthy, Donald Trump loudmouth, who you don't take seriously, but is causing trouble in the electorate. This movie is just great and so scary and so now. 